Hello first grade friends. In this video, we will finish up module 13.4, solve two digit addition and subtraction problems. We will be working on page 402, 402 in our Into Math workbook together. Let's start with number six. The directions say, solve, draw or write to explain. Number six says, Kathy sees 32 orange carrots and five purple carrots in the garden. How many carrots does she see? Let's start off by drawing our 32 orange carrots. I can show 32 by drawing one, two, three groups of 10 and two ones. One, two. Let's go ahead and label that that's my orange. Then, Kathy sees five purple carrots. So let's label purple. This is just a single digit, so I know that I will not be drawing groups of 10, but I will draw ones. One, two, three, four, five. Now, let's add them together. I have my three groups of 10. One, two, three. Then I'll add my ones. I have two ones and five ones. I know that two plus five is seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So all together, Kathy sees 37 carrots. 37 carrots. Let's look at number seven. Sam counts 50 potatoes. Jalen counts 30 potatoes. How many potatoes do Sam and Jalen count together? We're gonna solve this in two different ways. The first way is by drawing a picture. Let's start with Sam. Sam saw 50. One, two, three, four, five. Five groups of 10 equals 50. Jalen saw 30. One, two, three. Three groups of 10 equals 30. If I add these together, I know that five tens plus three tens would give me eight tens. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, which is the same as 80. I can also solve this by just using numbers. I know that Sam has 50 potatoes. Jalen has 30 potatoes. I can add them together. I'll start by adding my ones place. Zero plus zero is going to give me zero. Five plus three will give me eight. So whether you solve by picture or just by using the numbers, you should get that Sam and Jalen have 80 potatoes all together. Let's take a look at number eight. They want us to construct an argument. Mr. Caleb has 30 brown eggs. He has 20 more brown eggs than white eggs. How many white eggs does Mr. Caleb have? Let's go ahead and start with our 30 brown eggs. I'm going to label my brown and I know that I have one, two, three groups of 10 to give me 30. The next sentence says, he has 20 more brown eggs than white eggs. So what that is telling me is that Mr. Caleb has less white eggs than brown eggs. Specifically, he has 20 more brown eggs. That's two groups of 10. So if I have Mr. Caleb's brown eggs, I'm going to take away 20 more 
to show how many white eggs there are. So let's start by drawing one, two, three. Then we'll subtract this 20 more. That leaves us with one group of 10. So Mr. Caleb has 10 white eggs. They want to know, does your answer make sense? Explain. Our answer does make sense. This shows that Mr. Caleb has more brown eggs than white. He has 30 brown eggs and 20 less than 30 equals 10. All right, my friends, go ahead and work on the extra practice and homework page. If you have any questions, feel free to message me on Dojo or send me an email. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye-bye.